guys, Crew Blind Wave. I'm Eric. I'm Aaron. And we're doing Arrow! Uh, uh. Aaron, you are blending in with that background. Very green. Last I time on Arrow. Green screen, I'd just be arms and a head. Yes. <laughs> Last time on Arrow, um, Oliver gave up being Green Arrow, and Diggle is going to be a perfect Green Arrow. Possibly. Because uh, he can shoot is, a bow. That's the plan. He could. Uh, with his perfect health. Yep. Yep. Um, and then we all, what else do we have? There was a bad guy. Yep. That they fought. I think they made love to him. Who's the bad guy? I don't remember. <laughs> <laughs> Last episode they had, uh, Ratatouille. What's his name? Anatoly. They had Anatoly, Anatoly who kidnapped a Russian, uh, businessman mm -hmm. who said that if he was a green arrow he mm -hmm. would double his investment yeah but now he's dead so it don't matter what he said mm -hmm. <laughs> that's true that's sad. Yeah. um and then uh, he let Anatoly go Anatoly mm -hmm. go I'm not bad man because mm -hmm. if I was I'd take your child mm -hmm. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> right I'm honorable man all over. <laughs> he's like I don't I, kill the kids I know put bomb in I school have standards and, yeah he's like yeah. Uh, I don't know he's like, okay all right Anatoly sounds good yes that that was it uh, there's also a cop her name was Diana. No. Oh, you mean FBI agent? Yeah. Her name was Agent Sharp. No. Hmm. There's a lot of sharp in these kind sharp. of shows, but it's not sharp. Watson. Yes, because Sherlock. Yes. That's right. We had Watson. I'm gonna rewrite that down. What son? Watson. <laughs> and then we had the photo. It was evidence of Doctor. Of whatever. Yeah, it was doctored to Who look released? like all... What? Yeah. Someone doesn't know shit, because they doctored a Green Arrow photo to make it look like it's Oliver Queen. I think that's what it was. Yeah, that's what happened. They didn't create evidence to make it look like it was doctored, right? No. Yeah. They found um, evidence. And, yeah, and then we had a really cool new title scene with all the heroes. And then I guess they have to just cut off the Green Arrow one, or get rid of the Spartan one, I guess, so, or whatever so that was... He's gone. I don't know what happened. I don't know. He went behind the TARDIS. It looks like there's clothes flying all over the place. Oh, yeah, you got that in Millbag. You said about New Arrow. New yeah. like, logo. Ha ha! Yeah. Da 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 Aaron E. Yes. <laughs> okay, all right, I think that's gonna be it. Well, no, we had a poll. <coughs> really, we had a poll <coughs> last time, Aaron. That's why I went to go get my phone, but I changed my shirt when I did it, too. Arrow says, uh, do you think that the reasoning behind Oliver giving up his role as the Green Arrow justifies it being the fifth time he's done it? Oh, yeah, yeah. Um, you know what the I options were? Um, yes, no. Yes, exactly. What were the results? We had 44% say yes. Oh. And 55% say no. So more than half are saying it does not justify being the fifth Slightly time. more than half. Slightly more than half. Technically, it's 44 and a half and 55 and a half. Yeah. Right? Yeah. Uh, I said last time, I think it's the best reasoning he's had so far, but because it's the fifth time, I don't like it. What people say, Aaron? Mark says, I think this is the only time he has had solid justification. Agreed. Thank you, Mark. Um, Ryan said, I would say yes if I didn't know for a fact it wasn't permanent. Also, Diggle has a kid as well. That's true, Oliver's too. a dick. Yep. Ragnarok said, though, but he has Lila. William would have no one if Oliver died. What about Renee? What about Renee? Yeah. He's like, here, you can go with this does other it, superhero dude. Doesn't William have the <coughs> the nanny that was the housekeeper since season one? No. Nope. She does. Nope. She, what, she just leave him? Fuck you, kid! What do you mean? You're... He didn't have a housekeeper? Yeah, the Rosia, whatever her name is, the, the nanny, that's the housekeeper from season one. She, she's been taking care of William since season one? No, but she's she's his nanny now. Well, that didn't help anything. Well, it doesn't? You just have a nanny that just showed up after your mom died. It's not like, oh, you good. You got to take care of me when my I'm dad I'm just saying, he's like, he has nothing. He has nothing! No. Um, I Am Groot says, I dig it. Wink, wink. Uh, fat comic book guy says, Diggle has a son, but is not the only father he has. So you're if, allowed to just... If die. Oliver dies, William would have would be an orphan. Yeah. I think this is a valid reason, but I hate the show for doing this when we know Oliver will totally come back before mm -hmm. the crossover. <laughs> uh, Liam Cook says, if Diggle dies and the kid still... If, if Diggle dies, the kid still has a mother. Uh, M10th... M10th... 
Weird name. If you can't see the difference between two parents and one parent, then I can't help you, Eric. <laughs> I mean, I, I get what, what they're trying to say with that. I just think it's a poor justification when you, make, when you compare the two, if that's the case. Matt says yes, because this time he is thinking about his son. As a person that has lost one parent and still has the other, I mean, yeah, it's that's not a really good reason for me. Cameron says, I think it's an interesting idea, but I was pissed at the end of the episode when they handed it to Dig. Yeah. I watch Arrow to watch Oliver kick ass. I know he'll be back soon, but I don't really like the idea of Dig being the GA. Uh, it's not even that. Like, I could get behind it, uh, uh, Dig will be coming GA. It's the fact that he's lying to his team and directly putting them in danger. So and is it the, just because of Diggle having his issues that you don't like what has happened? No, I, I said last week it compounds the issue that I don't like that it's the fifth time it's happened, and it's the Diggle thing, yeah. But if Oliver doesn't know about the Diggle thing, it would make sense for him to hand it to Diggle. I mean, like I said, I get what they're doing. I personally don't like it. I think that if that's going to be the justification, like, well, he, he wouldn't have any parents versus, well, he would still have his mom. It's like, well, if that's the case, then I why mean, the fuck are anybody that, have, that has kids doing any of this? Because, what, it's okay for a kid to grow up? As long as he has one parent, he's going to be okay. I'm like, yeah, I get that, but doesn't that kid deserve to have both of his parents in his life? I mean, Diggle already went through this of deciding to stick with it even after having a kid. Yeah. That was a whole thing he had. Yeah. This is the first time Oliver's had to make yeah. that decision for having a kid. I'm saying, He's saying that it's probably best for him to step away yeah. to spend time with his kid, right? Sure. I, no, I don't think like I said, I get it, and people say, like, Eric, don't you get No, I get that. <clears throat> I personally don't like it and don't think it's a great justification. But of all the justifications we've had of him being, not being here now, it's the best one. But it being the fifth time, I'm like, who cares? We know that he's going to come back. They're not going to have a crossover with, with Diggle as a Green Arrow. I'm sorry, they're not going to. They should. <laughs> that, may, that may be cool, but they're not going to. That's what they should do. Like, fuck off! We yeah. got him! Look yeah. at this! <laughs> and he comes back the next episode. Yeah. <laughs> I mean, if they're not going to have, you know, Barry be gone for a little bit after that huge season finale of the consequence and what's going to happen, they're definitely not going to have Stephen Amell not be Green Arrow for multiple episodes. I mean, I, I said three at tops is what I would say. Gotcha. Yeah. Anyway, we gotta watch this episode, right? Mm -hmm. Let's see what happens. Maybe I'll change my tune. Woo! Do what? Can you do this? Is John Dick, and he is the Green Arrow. <laughs> Previously, <laughs> you made me miss that for that Alex. stupid. <laughs> He has a recurve bow. Shoot him! Shoot him! Oh, God. Whoa! Holy shit. No! Oh, damn. I could have went a little better. Fucking kill him! I was dying in this department. I, I don't know what I'd have done burning alone. But, uh, I mean, you'll figure it out. <laughs> but you're sending a message to the police of this city that they can't do their job without vigilante help. Well, they hadn't been. <clears throat> I'm glad I don't work for you. Things are a lot better in Central City. She's not wrong. They're like, hey, the Flash, yay! Yay! Hey, flash day! I think someone would, like, notice anything about, like, the new... Arrow. Like what, Eric? Find a solution. Like, he, yeah. like what? He's buffer. I'll try. Thank you. Be nice to have something before John. The buffer. Didn't you try to do the rags? Yeah, we heard you. Rag man. Rag man. What the? What is going on? Those guys were just waiting at security. Those are the best security guards ever. I thought maybe you could use a late afternoon snack. Are you my mother? I mean, that's not even accurate for my mother, really. God, he's attractive. Was cool. <laughs> he wasn't before? <laughs> mm. I don't know. Yeah. I'm conflicted. <laughs> Speaking of, how is William, now that you're done pulling double vigilante daddy duty? It's a two steps forward, one step back. Look at him, right at her legs. He's, he's can't help it. Just thinking that I'd really love to be able to lean on. 
Every time I open my mouth, I am making it worse. So the man who took down Damien Dark is bested by arithmetic. It wasn't my strongest subject in school. No, what was? Truancy? Charm. And no doubt. That wasn't a charm I guess class. you told him something along the lines of, just relax, it would have been... She's gonna to tutor William? Like I was asked. You make things so simple. Always have. Mm. 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 What do you think? Look at the stress. What do you think, Oliver? Curtis? This is so no messy. No wonder Core doesn't like to share their secrets. <laughs> Children of love Aquarius. Not safe on the road. It's a cool shot. Yeah. <laughs> yeah <horrible. laughs> Holy Why shit. Why would you go? Man, his voice modulator with the voice. I'll dig both. Oh, this. Perfect. Ignition blocker. Why do you hesitate on that? It wasn't like he had to shoot an arrow, just make a decision, left to right. I think they made a new the suit for him. He's so damn big. Two are in critical condition. What the hell, Hoss? There were two targets and two of us. What was so freaking complicated? I don't know. That's never happened to me in the field before. Also, I'm sorry about tonight. That wasn't me. Hey, when I said move on, I meant you too. Back in 2015, but last night, you said there were five. Oh. You think when Evita went rogue, not everyone went with her? Well, wild dog for the win. Three of her original members defected back to the CIA for a little while, at least. What do you mean for a little while? Because this guy and this guy were both killed in separate poison gas attacks last year, one in Missoula, one in Tripoli. Hmm. I'm guessing we should worry what this gas could do to a populated area. Oh, yeah. Look. Give me a map. It's going to show how much of... Oh. Oh! It's not a map, Eric. Oh, man. Anything that I can do to help? Uh, Get Felicity and tutor her. Equations. No. Um, those sound. He wouldn't pay attention. Vaguely. I'd be I'd pay. Again, I'd... We need you to come back. Hmm. Mm. Mm, not yet. Still working on a 20 with Reynolds. I mean, you got a point, though. It's gonna take yeah. a while. These black up guys are really I'm saying, thousands of people. Yeah, I don't think it's gonna happen yet, but. Okay, yeah. Okay, yeah. Yeah, I'll call. Can Please. I have the room, Felicity? Yeah, too. Okay, okay, bye. Bye. <laughs> okay, bye. Bye. You see, like. <laughs> bye. Uh, I'll see you. Weird. You can be a better hero than I ever was. Shoot a fucking arrow, please. How's it going in here? Will you be my new mom? Good. Yeah, I'd say we're Don't go there. making progress. Right. Good. Could you tutor me some more before the test? Um, yeah, I mean, if it's cool with your dad, it's cool dad, with me. Dad, could you? If it's cool with you, it's totally cool with me. Dad, shut the door. <laughs> You're awesome. Huh? She's pretty cool. Yeah, she is. We married both of you, little shit. Traffic cams pick up things more than great by the base out there. How'd they get in? Oh, that's a cool three shot. I'm Mr. G. Oh, sweet. Guys, we got two hostiles in the lobby.
need a way to neutralize the nerve gas. You could burn it, but I don't suggest it since you're still inside the building. We won't be for long, I hope. The breaches are too small to evacuate all these people. Which is why we're gonna make them bigger. How do you, how do you pop that like that? Can you blow it up? Going somewhere. And, uh, I wasn't gonna tell anyone about the gold. You know, it turns out money can buy happiness. It just can't buy peace of mind. The green door, man. So. Okay, that should be good for vigilante. Yeah, like, after everyone. Oh, people like this. Save the lives. Like Curtis and I have been working on a little something in our spare time. Very limited spare time. May I add? We call Crossbow. It the Green Monster, <laughs> or something cooler than that. Like pretty much whatever you want to call it. The important part is it shoots arrows instead of crossbow bolts. 260 pound draw weight. The arrows exit the gate at 400 FPS. That's feet per second. Integrated recoil energy dissipation system. Adjustable mount scope, quick detach, quiver, pistol grip, More like a gun. guards, non-slip rubber inserts. You two want a moment alone? You want to take it for a spin? Stabilizers on the crossbow? Nope. That aim there is pure John Diggle. Not a bad idea though for the next upgrade. So if we are going to decide on diverting police resources towards stopping them, we are not going to do that until the people of Star City have spoken. Oh! oh. Let the city decide. Vote. Fuck yeah! Vote. Fuck yeah! Democracy! Oh my gosh. <laughs> Can you believe he's your son? I didn't mean it. That's not what I meant. I mean. You Math isn't everything. I mean, you have you have so many redeeming qualities. You know, you have amazing abs, and I'm just gonna open this. Please. Okay. Are you sure? That's what you want. I'm oh, sure. Oh. Uh oh. They're singing. Uh oh. They're singing happening. That means banging, Aaron. So, Alicity. Huh? Alicity. I, I think you're gonna bring up first. Yeah! Not Diggle with the freaking drugs <laughs> in his arm for his arm. Alright, so Diggle is taking drugs <coughs> to stop the tremors. Tremor time. Mm. But hey, I mean, that's what people do. They take drugs to help their sicknesses. They just don't usually get them in back alleys next to strip clubs. True. Whenever it showed that, I'm like, Diggle in an alleyway. Shit. Shit. Yeah. Immediately, I'm like, yeah. that's what he's doing. Damn. Yeah. Like, like, you couldn't even fucking wait. Well, you said, like, right then. well, there's no tremors of degenerative. It's like, well, maybe it just took a break. Like, it stopped and it started getting worse, you know? Like, it gets better, it gets I worse. I think that's how degenerative works. It, it, does that mean it continues to get worse? Yeah. Yeah. It doesn't get better. It ain't worse. I'm not saying anything to say better, just like he control it better, but he couldn't control it anymore. He was like, fucking nice. shooting fun. Yeah. This is gonna be bad. Yeah. He needs to tell people or tell, tell something. Something. Yeah, he. He is actively putting people in danger by not telling them that their new leader is a drugged up. So he didn't shoot, not shoot arrows because he couldn't have because he's wiggly. Yeah, it says he's, he's he not. Just, an he just didn't doesn't feel comfortable shooting arrows because he just he, he likes guns. He's not good at shooting arrows. He likes guns. 
Yeah, he, shoot like I said last time, he's, he's not an He could have just done that. He's not good. He could have done he, it. He didn't. It translates. I wonder why he didn't. Translates. Probably because he couldn't. Probably because his. Cause he sucks he probably forgot to take his drugs. Couldn't do it. Yeah. <laughs> he just fucking. He beats people up and stabs with a fucking arrow. It's like, there. Um, <laughs> leaves, leaves evidence. So, in the beginning, she threw out those flashy balls. Yeah. And they said that they had broken vertebrae from blunt force trauma and stuff. Yeah. And I was like, what the fuck did those balls do? No. That fucking just fucked everyone up. Yeah. But they were just flashbangs, and then the other guys came in and just beat the fuck fucking out of them. beat everyone up. Yeah. And then just disappeared. Yeah. That's what happened. <laughs> they, they straight up, uh, shoot. Uh, Kino? Kino? his name from uh, Turtles 2? Oh, yeah, Kino! Remember when, like, the Raph? Yeah. He's like, okay, grab these. Make no jingles, right? Yep. And then you throw it down, like you have 30 seconds. Whoosh, and then, like, Raph comes in and, like, doo, 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 and he's gone. That's what he fucking did. Yep. They did that to him. That's what they did. So good. Fucking ninjas, man. <coughs> okay, now uh, we have a very clear Olicity turn back into it. We had that Skin earlier. Back didn't we? In. we did, but they were like, taking a break because the Williams thing makes them uncomfortable. Thank God they're doing that because it's not like. Fucking choose me or William, <laughs> you know? So there's none of that happening. He seems to have, he is letting, like, she gave him space, and he is inviting her back in, right? And yeah. And she invited him in. Because in the first episode, he said about, he's like, why don't we just wait and see, Yeah. like, what's going on with him? Yeah. And now he stopped with that, and now he's getting trying to get close with William. He brought him some fucking Monte Cristos or whatever. Yeah. I don't know what the fuck those are. Some yeah. Some ham cheese sandwich or something with fucking waffles. Yeah, that sounds awesome. I don't know. You know, this is awesome. It banged. Damn. It's banging again. That was a good outfit to be banged in, probably. Right? It look good. Aaron? I mean, yeah. Yeah. But it depends on ease. Ease? Yeah. Like, dresses are easy, too. Yes. Well, yeah. Like, it's hard to bang in that shit. You gotta take that outfit off. It's hard. There's pants. It's not hard to do. You gotta make a hole. He's an Oliver Queen. So? He could make a hole with an arrow if he wanted to. He doesn't have no arrows. He's not the green arrow anymore, Eric. He has an arrow somewhere. Doesn't. Which is. Sorry. Sing! <laughs> <laughs> that would be great! He, like, creates the hole and it just goes up in the air and she's like, oh, and then. No. That'd be terrible. Well, that didn't work. That'd be terrible. Okay, uh, Watson, the FBI. We're still. I'm still a little sick. We're, we're so. Forgive the, the watery eyes and the, the sniffies. Um, uh, Agent Watson. On the Diggle. On the Diggle. Had known associates listed. Yeah. Which, who all was on the bottom part? I thought was one Felicity was... Felicity and Wild Dog? I thought, and all I thought one was Samantha and she was crossed out. Because she's dead. So there's Wild Dog and Felicity and Lance. Lance. Laurel. Laurel. Laurel's crossed out. Yep. Okay. Doesn't know. Uh, he needs to make Curtis. some other friends. <laughs> right? You know? Curtis isn't up there. With Tommy Merlin. He died a long time ago. That wasn't a known associate? A long time ago. Laurel. Dead. Laurel would have been dead for a year or two. No, they probably put it up to her. It's like, who the hell is this? Because they saw Black Siren. I'm like, eh, that's not her. She's dead. And crossed her out. No such thing for Tommy. But she was known as the Black Canary, though. Remember? They mm-hmm. made a statue of her. Yeah. It's like she was outed as yeah. being a vigilante yeah. who is known for hanging out with Oliver. Yeah. It's not good. Mm-mm. And that was a new Black Canary. Yeah. That ain't good. Mm. Which they don't know who that is apparently because she's not on that list. Do they just accept as a new Black Canary? You know what? The only people he has on there as known associates is Lance, which he works with. Yeah. Renee, which he works, works with. with. And then Felicity, who he's banging. He banging good. That's not a known associates. She's not a very good agent. That's not known associates. That's terrible. They added Diggle. Diggle's the first one. He's like, hey, this used to be a bodyguard he had back when he was rich. <laughs> you know who was a good associate that we never <coughs> see ever? Roy. R- Ragman. Oh. What happened to him? He left. Yeah. Because his rag stopped working, right? Yeah, he did. He was going to Jerusalem or something to get him fixed back up. But I miss Ragman, man. He was pretty strong. He man. was cool. He was damn strong. Yeah. Man. What was um, also strong was that opening with Dick or jumping off a cliff and then Dinah fucking screaming him fucking this way and hitting a car. I, I, he just got killed. I was looking at it like, man, that was fucking cool. Yeah. But you know what would have been better? The rope? Just shoot an arrow and swing across. Yeah. You can't do that. No. 
What if she fucked up? What if she was like, <gasps> Wait, sorry, I got a cold. <laughs> I don't know. But no, that's sweet. You, you know, know what else is sweet? No Spartan helmet in the title. No sequence. Spartan helmet. <coughs> I think that does a disservice to Spartan. Spartan in himself is a superhero. He was awarded a medal by the president. He was just created for this show. No one cares. No one cares. No, no one cares. <laughs> It's like what they did with Dick Grayson. He became Nightwing. I'm like, oh, he should be Batman. It's like, no, he's Nightwing. Nightwing's like his own character. It's like, no, Batman. Yeah, but if Batman dies, then he can become Batman. Yeah, I know. I don't like that. Why? Just don't. You, you know what? Else? You know what I do like? Oh, and it's awesome. Batman. Wait, that what? There can be four fucking Robins. There can't be two Batmans. No, that's ridiculous. It's not ridiculous. It's not. Um, what I loved was that one shot, the fake one shot, but that one shot in the car. Going in the car, from the point of view of the other side of the car, <coughs> that was fucking awesome, man. <coughs> yes, I did like it too. There was a pretty long one shot before it went over. Yeah, like the little. There was, I think, I counted three cuts in it, but it was, you know, it was still awesome. And it was like a night. <laughs> yeah, like Freddy Krueger shit. Ah! Yeah, that was cool. so damn cool. We didn't really get to see exactly what Onyx could do, like hand to hand, that much because of it, but it was still cool. Yeah. You know, and it makes sense too, because she's like the Green Arrow is nothing. But she, whenever she saw her, saw him the first time, she just shot him. Mm -hmm. And then the second time, they actually fought. And yeah. Then he was more like yeah. formidable. Yeah. And you don't just shoot him. Very formidable. You don't think anyone's gonna notice any differences between what difference? Oliver. What are you talking about? Diggle. What? Like the body size is different, and just just the, the body size. Their 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 just stuff is different. <laughs> Some guys like man. Here got tan. <laughs> <laughs> right? I was just like, I don't know. I mean, there's been shots. Like, all he has is a mask and a hood, so you easily can see his chin. Sure. Right? Yeah. Like, if you just see, like, if you see their chin, you'd be like, that yeah. guy looks, that's a green arrow? I don't know what you're trying to say. I swear. I swear he's different. I don't know what you're trying to say. You're being really vague about what you're trying to say. What do you mean? No, we're not done. <laughs> um, <coughs> they covered on the kid, Lila, all that. Which is what I'd said is that he dealt with that before, I think. When yeah. he first had the kid. Sure. And decided to stick with this life, mm -hmm. which is kind of like a... It's kind of like... He's kind of like a soldier life still. Sure. Which, that's a decision on its own, too. Of like, am I going to stay a soldier with yeah. a family at home, or am I going to come back home? In terms of my... Because, I mean... Don't get me wrong, I thought like this episode was awesome and it handled what I would rather not happen well. Like in terms of what I don't like about it, number one is I don't like that I know that Oliver will be back as Green Arrow at some point. What if they don't? Number, it's not gonna happen. No, it just can't happen. Why? It just won't. But it's like things gotta move on. It just, Maybe Stephen Amell wants to move on and We just know it won't. Justice League Green Arrow. I mean, you want to bet? No. Yeah, that's why, because you know it won't. But it, it, I would love it if they're like, everyone's like, he's going to come back, he's going to come back, and they don't do don't it. Don't get me wrong. That would be ballsy, and that would be unexpected. Yeah. But there's no way in hell they would do it. They're not going to do it. Okay. So, never, so because of that, I'm like, oh, okay, well, we'll get over this at some point, even though I'm enjoying it. But there's that. And then after that is the fact that they've had, this is the fifth time he's given up. And then after that is like that. Well, he's giving up because of the only child or you know the only parent thing. You know, part of me is like, well, shouldn't it matter if you just have a kid at all, rather than just have one parent or two parents and stuff? But I'm saying that's like the third under the list of things I don't like about it. Yeah. In rank in terms of importance. I mean, if I don't think about it being like the fifth time of doing it, also I mean, I mean I would assume they would bring him back, but. If they went with an idea of like, let's not bring him back as Arrow, which they won't. I mean, there's just no way of it, right? I, I don't, I don't know. If yeah. I was writing it and I was gonna do something like that, I'd be like, let's actually stick with this for a while, if nothing yeah. else. Let's not do it for like a flash, a flash beginning season, and it's only sure. one or two episodes. Let's stick yeah. with it for like half a season at yeah. least, you know? Like, let's give it some time and make it where like he has to come yeah. back for a reason. Yeah. Like, what if William gets kidnapped? Mm -hmm. Well, then I might as well become Green Arrow and get yeah. him back, right? Mm -hmm. Like, that's what I would do. Well, he'd be kidnapped. I don't know. Because he's the mayor? <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I'm just saying, like, I think that would be a good reason. <laughs> you know, if they fucking... came in crossover time and they just fucking left Diggle as a Green Arrow, would it suck? I don't know. 
I think it would be kind of ballsy and cool to actually be like, guys, here. I think it would be ballsy and cool too. This is too. what we're doing, and be like, all right, Diggle's Green Arrow. Let's go with it. Let's get because I love John Diggle Jr. as Green Arrow. What, Connor Hawk. Connor that they Hawk, called yeah. him. Well, right? he was still Green Arrow, but they called him Connor Hawk. John Diggle Jr. Yeah. <laughs> I loved him as being Green Arrow. Me too. I liked it. That was cool. And Oliver Queen was old, and he's got to quit it sometime. Yeah. But he came back to help save the city again. Sure. Like have him come back to save a city, but not for like all the little itty bitty stuff. Let him be mayor because he's got yeah. be, someone's got to be mayor. Well, what I was gonna say is, isn't it far more dangerous in this city to be fucking the mayor than it is Green Arrow? It is. Yeah. You but, have no problem being the mayor. Still. But as you said before, who's better to be the mayor than the Green Arrow? He's, he's not the Green Arrow. He still has the skills though. He can be the he can be the Mayor Arrow. <laughs> mayor Arrow. Green Mayor. The Green Mayor. <laughs> uh, well, I love the crossbow. Yeah. And all the little gadgets it says it has. It's like a, uh automatic crossbow. I don't know how it redoes the that. Does it like how's it reach back and grab the thing? I don't know. I didn't pay attention if Me he had like a shotgunny thing. Because sometimes some of the like the crossbow bolts one will have like a like five of them in it. Yeah. But this one's set up to shoot arrows instead. Where was that at? No, no it's automatic. Didn't. So it, it's semi-automatic. Yeah. Well, he shoots it, and then how does the drawstring come back? He just does. Okay. I can believe it. I guess it's got to be like it's got to be set up with like a gun mechanism type of thing. Because like whenever you shoot a gun, it. Yeah. Automatically, so it has to like, and then pull back again somehow automatically or something. I don't know. Never like crossbows. Take too long to load. I say most of them are like, uh, uh, they they have like the, like if they're gonna have like multiples, like they do crossbow bolts and not arrows. I mean, not one that's two hundred and sixty pound draw. You'd have to have the, or the put it down. <coughs> What's Daryl's? Daryl's has to pull back each time, right? Yeah, he usually has to put it down and do this, but uh, and then hit the latch. But yeah. two hundred and sixty pounds. There's something like that, but like um, I think like Van Helsing with uh, Hugh Jackman. Yeah, like his was like pump action shotgun kind of thing, so yeah. it would pull back and pull it back, but then reload the next crossbow bolt. Yeah, sure. But he didn't need a ton of force because he wasn't like shooting yeah. super far. I don't think. Did that have some kind of like steampunky thing into it though? Not for that, I don't think. Okay. You have, cause it, has, it has to be really well made with a pump action and have it be like, shoot really hard. You know? Like a 250 pound crossbow. It, that's insane I to mean, think about. The thing with that, I guess, would be like a, a pulley kind of thing to help reduce the, the draw, right? Yeah. For like doing this. Like if you had like a pulley and a pulley, so they sh- yeah. to help reduce having to be like, oh! Yeah. But other than that, I don't know. But yeah. 250 pounds. That's crazy. Is that what they said that did? Yeah, that's what they said. I wrote that down. It's like, huh? Like, I remember shooting, like, like an 80-pound. I mean, to be fair, it was a compound bow. It wasn't a crossbow. But it's, like, it's compound, and you're, like, mm, and then you hit that part with the poison, and you're, like, dunk. And you're, like, oh, okay. And then when you release it, it's, fuck, you know, it's fucking. Wow. Wow. And if you don't have your guard on, it's, it hits the other right here. Oh. Ow. Um. Crossbow. Um, I, I like that there's a little tennis ball in that key. Yeah. <laughs> it made, uh, that was funny. I like the Oracle, uh, little <coughs> Easter egg we got. For the business? Yeah. She's like, Oracle, nah. <laughs> that was funny. Um, now, is this kind of setting up to a kind of big reveal for what the company's going to be, or, for, or are we just going to get Smoke Technologies? I don't know. Sure. Those two guys in the truck are dead. Yeah. Due to Team Arrow's incompetence. They don't say anything about that. What do you mean? They're dead. Because the guys are hiding in the back of the truck? Yeah. I guess. Well, just dead. No one said anything about that. It was Team Arrow's fault? Like, all right, well, guys, we're Why is it Team Arrow's fault? It's Team Arrow's fault. They're dead. I don't know. If I was there, they'd be fine. Maybe not. I don't know. The thing, the different thing, like, she shot Diggle here and then shot the other two guys in the head. <laughs> yeah. And then, um. Let's see that on Rebel. I think they made her, yeah, I think they made a re- like a new suit for him. Yeah. Because it is. As I said, he's not the same body type at all, though, yeah. Oliver. Yeah. Like, Oliver's ripped, but. Well, I don't mean, like, for production. Like, mm. is it supposed to be the same suit in the show? But obviously, when they were filming it, they're like, well, he won't fit in little Stephen Amell's suit, so we gotta make a n- newer one. Oh, it's probably supposed to be the same. It's probably why every time he walks in, he's like. Has it opened? Yeah, can't breathe. Okay. Dude, 
I'm excited to see what happens with uh, the chapter nine thing. Having like yeah, having the, the city decide about vigilantes. Because uh-huh. like he said, we just had. I'm sure the night before, two nights before, whatever it was, there was an incident where like 12 people went to the hospital and two were in critical mm-hmm. condition and all mm-hmm. that. Mm-hmm. But then he had a nerve gas thing that saved how many lives? Yep. You remember the other bomber who were like, it was like in a park? Yep. And like, there were like so many people there that were saved and mm-hmm. fucking the season one finale. Yep. Like so many people were going to die there. Like he saved a lot of lives. Yep. But of course that wasn't him. Yeah. Like, not And him. Uh, Central City uh, does it fine, so. It would be cool if it came out where if if the if the town decides not to do that and then somehow they embrace the 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 heroes, right? And then he comes back as Brunero. Then be a good time for him to come back. Like but right now still be in danger. Right now he has William and he has the FBI after him. Mm-hmm. But if he gets with Felicity where, and they get married, then there's another kid. Another parent for that kid. <laughs> another kid. Well, there might be another kid. But, but no, what I was going to say like, is, if he stays Green Arrow right now, not only if he dies would William lose him, if he just stays a Green Arrow and gets caught, William could lose him to prison. Sure. So there's there's issues of him being Green Arrow in general right now. Yeah. So if Diggle gets caught, maybe Lila can pull some shit. <laughs> yeah. I, I don't know. When he comes in, like he gets arrested and immediately back yeah. out. Of course, she, she couldn't do that when he was in that gulag mm-hmm. prison place before. Mm-hmm. That place sucked. Yeah. It wasn't really a gulag, but yeah, sucked. Hey, you know how they put the, their costumes back on the mannequins and then put them in the glass thing? How long do you think, think it takes to like, oh, shit, we got to go, and then run over there? <laughs> you know, it takes a long time, doesn't it? Probably not as long as it takes to do cornrows. Well, I was gonna. Well, that's true. But I was gonna say like Flash. I can see him. He takes it off. Doesn't ten, you know two seconds. But like Diggle has to like. Oh, I have my suit. Oh shit! It's on the mannequin. Damn it! Why do we keep doing this? When when I was. It looks cool though. <laughs> when I was at uh, Dragon Con, I went to the Arrow panel, and they had people lining up for questions, and I wanted to go up and ask a question about mm-hmm. the cornrows. That's what I wanted to do, but there was such a long line for people yeah. asking questions. I was like, I'll just wait. What were you going to ask? I was going to ask, like, how fast can Curtis do cornrows when he has to get out on the yeah. street? And someone else asked that question. And they're like, you know, this has been brought up before. Yeah, I know that he gets annoyed by that question. He's like, this has been brought up before by uh, different people, and we've talked, and, like, he, he was like, uh, it's been joked that maybe Curtis is a metahuman, but his meta power is that he can make cornrows real fast. <laughs> <laughs> That's funny. Uh, I was like, oh, okay. All right, we got to do some Q&As. <coughs> is that one got anything else? You, Aaron? No. All right, guys, so this is going to be at hashtag arrow Q&A. Arrow Q&A. Uh, and uh, we'll go through and answer some of these questions. Okay. Or tots. Okay. You can go to Twitter, at BlindWinProd, hashtag arrow Q&A. We'll answer your questions as best to our ability. All right, Speed King says, what do you think of Oliver's speech to John? I think that John will be a good green arrow for a while. Um, if as, as long as he doesn't keep doing drugs. Because I, I like everything else, honestly. I mean, John is a good fighter. He has earned his stripes. He was there at the beginning. Uh, he can finally shoot arrows. I mean, granted, you'd probably have... He's... John's awesome. I mean, realistically, I'm thinking, like, well, you're going to need to practice a little bit more before you're that good, but it's a, this is a superhero show, so I can buy that, right? Yeah. Um, and his skills should be able to translate over a little bit. Now, the fact that he's shooting actual arrows and not bolts is interesting, but cool, too. So, I like it. And it matches with, like, next episode, if he shoots those, oh, arrows are shot. Yeah. As long as I don't see any pictures of them, they're good. Sure. Toast Knight said, I'm really gl- glad that Renee went to Oliver. It was absolutely the right call, and it yep. led to that great talk between Oliver and Diggle. Yep, agreed. I don't think it was unreasonable for him to go and be like, hey... Look, there was issues. Yeah. Thousands of people could die. Yeah. You know, there's a, there's big stakes on the table. It was the right and responsible thing to do. Um, if, any, if anything, fucking Dinah hasn't said anything to anybody else about this stuff. And that is not great. I get the point of, like, not wanting to undercut chain of command kind of thing. Yeah. Because, like, if they don't trust up above, then, you know, they're not going to listen. And then it could cause more problems on the field, too. Yeah. I think maybe telling... Oliver, or mm-hmm. like going with Diggle, like Diggle, we're gonna go tell Oliver, let's go together. Mm-hmm. 
and getting Oliver to know would mm -hmm. be the better option. Mm. But then if they take him off with Green Arrow, then who, who's Green Arrow? Who's going to lead? Someone else. Who? Someone. Something? Yep. Else. Isn't, there isn't anyone else. Curtis? Roy. Where's Roy? Somewhere. I'd bring him back Somewhere. if he would, but I don't know where he is. Toast and I said, hey, Aaron, maybe Felicity can tutor you, too. She's got to be great at reading with all the magic hacking she does. Mm -hmm. For some reason, I feel like I wouldn't pay attention. I pay all the attention. I, th I think you're missing the point. I think you're missing the point. Nope. I think I'd get straight A's, because I'd be like, can we, keep, can we keep doing it? I'd get straight D. <laughs> you would get straight D? Huh? No, you're missing the you point. You get the D? You're missing the point. No, you think you missed the I point. I think you're missing the point. I think you didn't think that through. You need tutored. Nope. No, you're missing the point. I get straight D. Uh, one. That's what it sounds straight. like. It was. Huh? Never mind. You get D, Aaron. No. Uh, you're supposed to give D. No, you're a, a straight D. I, I, know, I know what you're trying to say, but it sounds like I get straight D. No, you don't understand. If you take out straight. One day when you're old enough. All right. Is there a age to your <laughs> behavior? Spartan465. Yeah. How do you feel about this whole Diggle line to the team? Does it feel too played out? Uh, <coughs> no, it doesn't feel played out. I mean, Oliver giving up being Green Arrow is played out, but that at least seems a little fresher. The which? Hmm? The what? The, it doesn't seem played out that Diggle's line to the team. No, I don't think so. I said Oliver giving up being Green Arrow is played out. Oh, okay. Isaac, what biological ramification do you think that drug at the end will bring to Diggle? Maybe make him angrier? Like a steroid? Maybe. Mirakuru? Mirakuru? It was yellow, right? Or, like, let's say... You know what needs to happen? It would be fucking awesome if he's taking this drug and then eventually the, the effects wear off or he gets a tolerance or something he gets a degenerative and the Oliver comes back and, and now you know, Diggle's like down and out like oh shit I can't do anything I've lost the will to move and stuff and then fucking the Green Lantern alien crashes and dies and the fucking ring goes to John Diggle and then he can create shit with his will you're, you're getting ridiculous that'd be amazing he could be Green fucking Lantern in this not Green Arrow Green, okay. You know what I'm saying? I love it. We haven't seen. Because he doesn't need to have shoot guns and shit with his ring. I mean, bring Green Lantern, I guess, to TV. He didn't do too well in movies. You'd be John Diggle, would be a good Green Lantern. Yeah. He'd be like John Stewart. The only thing with doing Green Lantern is that it would be like everything CGI pretty much, you know what I mean? Yeah, fucking Supergirl. Yeah, but everything he does is. CGI. It's, that's not that bad. It's like, you know, a lot of TV shows, like, have, like, a smoky uh, power, like, you know, Lost and Supernatural and stuff. Like, that kind of stuff is actually not too hard to do. Smoke? Yeah. Yeah. Sm smoke's like, like, smoke and, you know, energy and, and, you know, so, like, the green stuff from that would be pretty... I'm saying everybody has to attack something. They have to make a CGI gun, yeah. a CGI hammer, yeah. and a CGI boat, stuff and a gets CGI cheaper. dick, and it's whatever they want to make. That stuff gets cheaper and cheaper every year. They did fucking Ghost Rider this season, when they just, last season when they did the Yeah, show. but he wasn't fiery in every episode he fought. He fought by himself I'm without saying all fiery it. and shit. They could do it. I'm just saying. Yep. Kevin said, hats off to James Bamford. The one-shot car fight was top-notch. Also, the Oliver Diggle moment got to me. That was awesome. It wasn't truly one-shot, but they, they do at least make an attempt to hide their cuts a lot, so... B. Mike says three things. One, I fall in love with Felicity more with each episode. Yep. Two, cool crossbow. Three, yep. WTF Diggle. Yep, drugs. I think they're doing Felicity well the last season and this season. I bet you would want to do Felicity um, well. And the crossbow idea is cool. I like that. Get that. And then we talk about Diggle. Yeah. Love of Tragedy said, what having more damage makes Diggle a bad green arrow? Oh, wait, hang on. Huh? We are talking about that. Never mind. Next yeah. one. Okay. Um, Chris says, I love Laurel, but she wasn't like the Black Canary I grew up with. But Dinah is. I love her so much, plus that suit, though. Mm hmm. I think this new Dinah's been doing really well. Yeah. Right? Yeah, I mean, you know, Laurel wasn't really given the chance to become the Black Canary that you know. Um, but, I mean, she's amazing as Black Siren, Katie Cassidy. Yeah. So. And then, yeah, Dinah Drake. 
Sure, yeah. Laurel, I thought, went with, like... I, I hate that the season that I started really liking her is when she got killed off. Sure. But I think she would have been there. Of course, she was talking about retiring anyway from being Black Canary, mm-hmm. so... I don't know. But this new Dinah is awesome. Yeah. I think she's doing a really good job. I like her, like, I like her interactions with everybody. Yeah. Um, and she's hot. Uh, AWPWN, Oppone. Mm-hmm. Do you think they'll recreate this famous Green Lantern, Green Arrow cover? It shows Speedy with apparently a drug problem. <laughs> yeah, Speedy was the classic, uh... That, that was, like, the first big thing when it came to having uh, a drugged-up character. Because, you know, the comics code, back in the day, they weren't allowed to address that thing. They couldn't only do sex, they couldn't do drugs, especially hyper, hyperdermic uh, needles and stuff. Good. So, but that was, like, one of the first things they did with Speedy being a uh, druggy. Well, I don't know. Maybe. Maybe they'll touch on it. Um, they've had... Theo had a drug problem oh, yeah. back they, in they, season I mean, she, one or yeah. two. That's what came, it came from, because she's speedy in this. Um, was. Now she has a coma problem. Roz Him says, what do you think will happen when Oliver and the team finds out that Diggle is, has this problem? Uh, they get kicked out. They'll get the intervention uh, sign out. Um, have an intervention in the cave. He could be suspended, maybe, but I could see them trying to find a, a solution to his nerve damage. Yeah. Rather than just having like a uh, what, what's what's the word? Like I want, like I think they find something to fix it rather than just something that just kind of stalls it. Yeah. Um, whenever, whenever Curtis and Felicity uh, were like, we're working on something for you. It turned out to be the crossbow, but I thought for a second that they had told him and that they were gonna like make a new chip. <laughs> yeah. But they didn't. Um, Crusader says Felicity's the best stepmom. Uh, haters, Felicity haters, who? Come on, how can you hate that? <laughs> I don't know. That's amazing. Um, I'm to the top here. Magnus says, How many episodes do you think Diggle will remain the Green Arrow? Unlike Flash, it has lasted more than one episode. Um, I'm gonna say maybe two more. Like, this was in Act One. And then we're going to get into the drug thing. That'll be Act 2. And then we'll resolve it, Act 3. And then all are back. I'm hoping longer. Yeah. I'm kind of wondering, like, could they go to the crossover and do kind of what they did with Thea last season? Because remember how, like, she's like, I'm done. And then comes the crossover, she's like, I'm going to fight aliens. Yeah. <laughs> you know what I mean? Or like, uh... <laughs> <coughs> Whenever Oliver wasn't Green Arrow anymore, but he was like Ra's al Ghul, but he came over to Flash and helped anyway when they asked for help. Yeah. And he fought you know, off uh, Reverse Flash. Mm. Nanites, Knights, courtesy of Ray Palmer, they disable your speed. Remember that? That was so yeah. awesome. Yeah. Um, 12 Cat, isn't this, Isn't the uh, CIA woman, isn't she FBI? Is she's she FBI. CIA? I think she's FBI. Awesome. Uh, do you think Watson's just going to ask, why is this Green Arrow now using a crossbow instead of a regular bow? Probably. Well, it depends no. if they, get a, they gotta get a picture zone. Yeah, they can just, they that's, why, that's why they, sh- they shoot arrows, not crossbow bolts. And as long as they avoid, like, any cameras and stuff, yeah. and watch out for what they're doing, they should be fine. And I think usually they probably hack it. It'd be funny if he just punch fuckers and they just... <laughs> uh, Sonny really said, did you feel like Onyx was very one-dimensional? Um... I don't know. Kind of, I guess. Yeah. I guess so. There wasn't yeah. a whole lot to her. She was just a one-off, I think. Yeah. Here's the bad guy this week. The real bad guy was drugs. And nerve gas. Um, Sunny also said, are we back to square one with Felicity and Oliver? Seems like they're back to the season three dynamic. Do you feel that we have earned it? Uh, I absolutely feel like we've earned it because they took a step back because of William and then they had that really cool scene with them three in the in the in the what's it called, the food, the Monte Cristo, the Monte Cristo, Monte Cristo thingies. Um, yeah, I feel like we earned it. And <coughs> I mean, there's I, I can't say it every week, but there's gonna be people that are gonna absolutely hate and think it's the worst thing ever. And I be mean, like, these writers suck, but I don't. The, we had last season that kind of I felt built their like friendship and the relationship back up and everything. Yeah. And then this one here, it feels like they're going slower. And he gave her a key to the house. Yep. It's not like living together. It's yep. not marrying each other. Yep. It's just, hey, 
feel free to come over whenever. They get back right? together. They get married. She he he has a new step parent. He can become Green Arrow again. Yeah, but it doesn't have to happen like immediately. I say they just roll with this and let them just kind of be together. Sure. They don't have to be like get married this this season oh, or anything. I mean, just I can see them getting married this season. I mean, they could, but I don't want them to like be rushing stuff. Yeah. You know what I mean, I'm just saying they got so damn close with their, you know, with the you know fiance thing back then and all that stuff, and then. The bullshit with her fucking standing up, putting the ring down, walking away. Yeah. <laughs> that, at least that bullshit's gone. This stuff is actually compelling to me, so. Yay. Lover says, Shimi says, do you think Williams would be okay with Oliver dating Felicity? I think so. It wasn't like him and his mom were together. Um, you know what I mean? Yeah, I mean, he might be a little miffed that Oliver's macking on his girl because he likes her so much because she's so damn hot. Chicken Noodle Soup says, I can't remember if she's done it since season one, but her babble in this episode. So yay, babble Felicity. No, she had a lot of babble moments in every season. It's just that there are certain times when people are not liking her that they find it annoying. But no, I, I, I've always really liked it. Um, and I always liked her babbles better than Curtis's. Sometimes Curtis is, especially yeah. with, was it last season, when like not only was he just getting his ass kicked, he would just babble, and it yeah. was like I don't get why you're babbling right now. Yeah, like the suit up. He does the suit up thing all the time. He does the suit up thing all the time. And it's like how many times can we have him just do the suit up thing and mess it up and try to explain why he messed up and he can't do it here. I kind of talked over it in the beginning. I was like, wait, did they do the suit up thing again? Uh, it must have been stupid. But I wasn't paying attention. Pepsi Queen says, do you think it would be funny if they used the Spartan symbol, but then put the arrow on top of it? <laughs> that would be cool, I guess, but he's not Spartan <coughs> Arrow. He's Green Arrow. Hey, Crusaders said, most important question of all, when's Ragman coming back? Right? Apparently someone else thought of that when they were watching it as well. Yeah. Fucking Ragman. Noodle Soup says, do you think that when it comes out that Diggle's using these drugs, this unlegalized medication, that Renee, it will hit Renee the most? This wasn't his wife doing drugs. Mm. Isn't that who killed her? Was the druggie who mm. she owed money to or something? Mm. Mm -hmm. Yeah, it might. Where do you think Slade's at? I don't know. I haven't seen him in he two episodes. He should have came back and been Green Arrow. <laughs> no. We need, How awesome would that be? No, we need him to be Deathstroke. Could you imagine if he has like the, the mask on and then he's, it's like one, only one of the eyes is there? That'd be kind of cool. Yeah. Just for like a little bit, have him be Green Arrow. Uh, Can't wait, I didn't think about him whenever I was like, who, could, who, else, who else could it be? Well, that was our Q&As, everybody. Make sure when you're watching next week, you do your Q&As. Twitter, <coughs> at BlindWaveProd, hashtag Arrow Q&A. All right, Aaron, we got to think of a poll for this episode. Poll is... Yeah. Speaking of voting and polls, we have a poll kind of in show, a vote for... This uh, vigilante legal, uh, what is it? Legal legends? <laughs> legislation. There's, yes, there's a vigilante legislation. They're chapter yep. nining it, yep. which is going to make it a uh, city referendum. Yep. Referendum. Yep. Referen yeah. That's so, it. does the city support vigilantes or will they vote against vigilantes? I'm hoping they vote for vigilantes. Like, they're not hunting him down. You I think, think you'll think they will. I think before. Oliver made a good point of like they just saved the city, not uh -huh. the city, but a lot of people, uh -huh. and to have the police force that they're trying yeah. to rebuild have to be chasing these people who are trying to also save people uh -huh. seems counterproductive. I'm gonna say no because they lost this week their uh, the favorite uh, karaoke singer because uh, that guy in the truck that was singing like an angel he died and uh, that was. A while the vigilantes were there, so they're all going to say no because they don't get to hear his his voice anymore. Go to patreon.com where you can find that poll and all the polls. Make sure you subscribe. And uh, what else, Aaron? Anything else for the end card? We only got a couple seconds left. Do you want to say anything? Want to get the D again or something? Or... It means you're getting dicks.